hardcover. This one's really fun. It's beachy. It's really like a cool blue color. Um, like it says ride the waves, make a splash, beach rules. Like it's just a really fun like summery kind of journal. Um, this one is called Subway Art Beach Rules Journal. And I didn't write in this one yet. So that one's really fun though. And the words kind of are stuck out on the front. Um, and then it's a really pretty blue. This next one I absolutely love. It says create your own happiness. The journal is by Molly and Rex. Um, it has assorted full color pages. I mean, look at this. It's just gorgeous. And it is a little bit, it's not a hardcover style, but it's a little bit more flimsy, but you can see the beautiful gold in there. And there's the back. Um, inside, to give you an idea of the really cute pages, like, look at this, just beautiful, really cute pages, lined, they're all lined, but they're just, like, really, really fun colors, and, um, they do change, I'm gonna try to find a different one, here we go, so, this one's purple, beautiful little journal, I can't wait to use this one, um, it's just so pretty, I really love this one, this one, oh my goodness, I think I got this for my birthday, or maybe Christmas, this one is a Kate Spade journal, um, and it's obviously black with the gold, um, it says with freedom, books, flowers, and the moon, who could not be happy? That's kind of cute. Um, it has the polka dots on the inside, nice gold polka dots, super cute, and then just lined pages. Haven't used this one yet either, you will see I have a million that I haven't used. This one I've had for so long, this one is a Pierre Belvedere, made in Italy. This one feels really soft, I love the feel of this one, I can't describe it, it's like cork feeling but then soft it's so cute it just says like different things design inspiration observation notes whatever um blank paper great size but it's just so soft i just love it and it's really cute love it's one i did buy for myself it says she's real without even trying and that what oh okay this one I absolutely love and it says she's real without even trying and that's right there and that right there is natural beauty it was just an unknown thing really cute journal look at this so colorful and i love like bright colors the back has just like this little bird on it and flowers it's just really cute um oh this this is a really good one <laughs> i love this one so this one's really cute it just has like a little something there cute little flower um this one does have different pages throughout so, and they kind of just like look painted. So this one has flowers and then you can see that on the side, kind of splattered. Um, what else is there in here that I can show you? Yeah, like another one, just got like a bird. Really cool journal. Um, the brand for this one for you guys, let's see. Love it when they don't have brands on here. It's like super not helpful. Okay, this one is designed and illustrated by Sarah Beetson. Um, and, and the company that makes it is Compendium, um, and it says Live Inspired. So the brand that it's made, it's, it's, or the company that makes it is Compendium. These types of books, again, you could look online. Um, don't know what these would really be called, but it's just kind of like a colorful journal. I'll give you the name of the illustrator again. I would look up her name, uh, Sarah Beetson, and I would, I would say check that out. Um, and again, the company who did it is Compendium, so check it out. This is a really fun one. It is a little whale journal. Um, the little books like this is usually what I'll use for like any kind of church notes or if I'm like reading, um, some sort of spiritual thing, then I kind of, you know, put any notes in there. These are again, so cute. Like look at the little fishies. So bright and colorful. I love when they have journals that where they're like fun, so. Yeah, it's got like a little veil. So just fun illustrations. This journal is um, by, made by Chronicle Books. In case you catch that, I want to write it down. Chronicle Books. This is a fun one. This one says Dream, Inspire, Create. It's a minty color with a really pretty gold on it. Um, this one is another Molly and Rex journal. Uh, this one, I'm not sure where I got it from. Um, just lined, I haven't used it yet. Really cute journal though. Love the gold. Another one that I haven't used, this one has sunglasses, and the funniest thing that this journal is a Peter Popper Press one, um, and it's called the 50 Shades Journal. So I thought that was really funny because it's got like legit shades. <laughs> okay. Um, nothing in here yet, of course. This one does have the lovely 
pouch in the back. Let me open this up. So it does have a pouch in the back. If you love the pouch ones, hard feel to it. Really funny. It says 50 shades on there. We're getting to near the end almost. All right. This next one's really cute. Another Peter Popper. Um, it is a cupcake journal. And as you can see, there's like lots of cupcakes. It's really fun, really colorful, hasn't been used. This one I've definitely used because I didn't really absolutely love it, but I wanted to use it. Um, it has like little birds on it. And again, it's like one of those small hard copy ones or hard covered ones. It has a pouch in it. Again, these ones are great for pouches. And in this one, I just kind of, again, housed those random things that I was either needing to do. Um, but yeah, this one again is Peter Popper. My other favorites, this was one of my first that I ever got because one of my best friends, Brianna, had the same one or had a similar one. I was like, oh my God, I'm obsessed. I love it. So I went and got a very similar style and it still is one of my favorites because I have a lot of memories with her and like all of our journaling and stuff. So something we have in common. Um, yeah, and just like in here, I just had again, like random things that were happening kind of fun because I like keeping these things so that you can go back and reminisce if you ever wanted to because they're all just like such different times so it's really cool so that's that one another Peter Popper this one I believe I got really good on sale so it's kind of like a blue and brown color with the flowers on it this one, this one's just random stuff again, just things that I was thinking about and I would go through these things like really fast, it's kind of crazy. But yeah, really cute. This one I tried to decorate a little bit. I love this one. It's got a really just like nice little accent of flowers. Um, they're blue, of course, which is like one of my favorite colors. Moving on to some smaller journals that I have and some ones that I've never used. We used to have this wonderful store in Edmonton called Notables and I really now regret I should have bought the store literally because and just like figured out a way to buy it because I absolutely love stationery. It was a full stationery and gift shop. It was awesome. It was so great. I used to work there when I was younger, um, like really young. And I regret it. I'm like, why didn't I figure it out and like buy that store? Cause it would have been like heaven. And anyway, so I got this from there. It's so cute. It's like the tiniest little notebook. But what I loved about it is the materials are recycled material. And it's like almost made out of Oh my gosh, what would this be? It's like foamy feeling, but it's just really cool. It's, um, the designer is Joshua Davis, if you're interested in him. Um, and it's just like kind of graph paper in it, but it's so cute. This one is a pretty new one. Um, this one just has like travel little things on it. Uh, this one is made by Lady Jane Limited and it's just like a little travel journal. I literally picked this up somewhere and I don't even know. But I was like, ooh, I like that. This is one of my favorite journals. It is the funnest material ever. I got it in 2000. Oh, weird. Okay, wait. There's one missing. Oh, I'll show you that one after. So it says 2003, but I got this. Oh, yeah, 2003. Why does it feel weird? Anyway, me and Andrew have been together since 2004. I got this. This thing is made in 2003. It's called Tri Coastal Design, and you can get it at tricoastaldesign.com. I would check them out because they're probably really cool. It's like a plasticky feeling. These are great. Again, I got these from Notables, which was this little store we have. These are by Pierre Belvedere. Oh, I think all of them are. Um, and two are by Studio O. So if you want to check them out, I've got a gratitude journal so you can put in, you know, things you're thankful for every day. This one is like a shopping list journal. So here it's like shopping list where you can check it off, but you can actually rip out the page. It's perf perforated so you can rip them out and take it with you if you have like a grocery list. This is like more of my to-do list. And then I got a grocery one, which is like actually grocery lists. So again, same thing, perforated, but it's a grocery one. A password one. This, these two are Pierre Belvedere. The one with the cool little peacock feather. And then this guy, both Pierre Belvedere. These are both Studio O, the gratitude journal and the internet like password journal. So really great. Internet password, so here is what it looks like. You could probably create something like this on your own if you didn't want to buy the journal. Gratitude journal, that one's fun. Yeah, here is a really beautiful one. This one is like leather, very cool. It's like kind of flimsy. Um, and this one, I was writing positive quotes in here. Very good. So different qu uh, quotes, and I'll probably keep 
This one's really cool. I got this one from H&M. It just says hello. It's covered by plastic and you can like, like the plastic piece, you can take it off and put a new one back in. This one is awesome because it has month on two pages, which is why I bought this. And then it has like your note section. So you get a month on two pages.